Welcome back to Manila, you guys. Today we are super psyched for watching our first basketball game here in the Philippines. We're watching a loser out playoff matchup. The reason we chose this game is because one of the stars, Jonathan Williams, actually played for my hometown team, the Gonzaga Bulldogs. Two-handed jam, Jonathan Williams. He was the star on one of our best teams ever and made it all the way to the national championship. That's Williams. I can't wait to watch him dominate again today and hopefully move on to the next round. So basketball is the most popular sport here in the Philippines. We read online that the fans can be super passionate and enthusiastic. I'm so excited because I'm not in my normal everyday life like a sports fan, but I love going to sporting events. Like the vibe and the energy just gets me so like hyped. I just love it so much. And actually the arena here is kind of crazy. Can you see it over here behind me? The arena here is attached to the Mall of Asia. It is the fifth biggest mall in the world and the biggest mall here in the Philippines. And they have their own sports arena, which just blows my mind. This is where I Perfect, thank you sir. Beautiful guys, I appreciate your time, thank you. Perfect. I appreciate it. Thank you. Have a good day. So it was not easy getting tickets online. We wanted to get the best seats possible, of course, but they only accept Filipino credit cards. So we had some issues. So we messaged Jonathan Williams on Instagram. He was nice enough to pick up with you tickets, which is awesome. It was a long shot, but we decided to shoot our shot because I had a basketball play. Anyway, it was so great. We messaged him and he answered and got us tickets. How sweet is he? So. Thank you, man. We yeah. appreciate it. So we bought two extra tickets. We think these are like the third row. So amazing seats that we're going to try to give away to somebody. We're going to head over to the Mall of Asia and hopefully find someone to give these tickets out to. Next thing we have to do is find a t-shirt or jersey to support the Phoenix Fuel Masters. Some merchandise. We need some team merchandise. Wow, it is so crazy here, right? Busy. Busy. So busy. All right, we're trying to find the jerseys, but so far we've asked a couple people and we've gotten what sent to the NBA store. No luck yet, we're gonna keep trying. I'll ask a few more people. Yeah. We gotta find some basketball fans. Wow, that's adorable. Thank you guys. What is that? Is there any place to buy like a PBA jersey or t shirt to support the teams tonight? It's not, uh, that's my friend. Tommy just asked some security guards where we can go find some jerseys or t shirts and. They're, they're talking with each other, trying to help us out. Everyone's so sweet, but why is it so hard to find a t-shirt? If you want to come, just try at the Mawa Arena if you sell a PBA t-shirt. At the arena? What time do they open? Uh, one hour before the game. Okay, thank you very much. That was helpful. So from what we're finding, all the people we keep asking, basically you can only buy them at the arena, and the arena doesn't open until one hour before the game, so. On to the next order of business, which I'm hungry. we're starving, and we know just the place to go eat. It's so busy in here. Ooh, I feel like I need like a celebratory picture in the entrance with the sign. Is that too cheesy? Look at this guy. Oh, that's cute. Would you like to play my cash? so busy and they have like somebody at the kiosk is helping you order. We just ordered a little bit of everything because I don't know, we don't know. Pretty funny we got our buzzer, which is fitting because Jolly Bee's a bee, you know? Buzz. Thank you, appreciate it. Dinner is served. <laughs> I think we ordered a lot of food. Our first time in Jolly Bee. So as we were walking around our neighborhood yesterday, we always ask people, where should we eat while we're here? And a bunch of people, a lot of the kids as well, said, you gotta go to Jolly Bee. So of course, we're here today before the basketball game. We ordered a few different items. We have no idea what to try. We've got the spaghetti, the chicken burger, a hamburger. So we're pretty excited. First time here at Jolly Bee. So the most interesting thing to me is the spaghetti at a fast food place. We've never had that before, and it comes with a piece of chicken. We read the chicken here is supposed to be like spectacular. But well, let's try the spaghetti first because it's super interesting and different. Go in for a minute. Is it everything you hoped and dreamed for spaghetti? It is better than I expected to be honest. <laughs> it's a little sweet actually. But the sauce is pretty good. I didn't expect much. My dad makes the best homemade spaghetti ever in this world. But for fast food spaghetti. But for fast food spaghetti, it's legit. I got no complaints. So this whole tray was only just under $9. 
which is a heck of a deal too. All right, what do you think of the fried chicken, babe? This is delicious. I'm ready to chow down. It's like really good fried chicken. Yeah, How's the gravy? So good. When we were in line, I asked the girl her favorite thing, and she said the chicken sandwich. So let's try a bite of this. The chicken's where it's at. Oh. That looks like some radioactive cheese. I'm not sure if they're known for their hamburgers, but that does not look the most appetizing. Let's try this side. I feel like this is super similar to that original McDonald's cheeseburger. Just a little too much cheese. And for dessert, we got the Coke ice cream float, soft syrup with chocolate syrup. Yeah, that's good. Good carbo loading before the game. Definitely. <laughs> I don't think we could have came on a crazier day here to Jollibee. Great first experience though. The highlight of the show was the fried chicken and gravy though. If we came back, that's definitely what we'd order. And of course the Coke float. Okay. How can you not love that? Now, it's time for a drink. A pre-game drink. Time to pre-game. Pre-game. I like where your head's at, wife. Yeah, sounds great. <laughs> I know. It's a really great atmosphere, right, for families? A bunch of rides. It's like a little mini carnival. Yeah, it's like a fair, and it's Sunday, so everybody's out. There's kids and families everywhere. Really great energy, right? Yeah. All right, thank you, man. What was your name? I'm uh, Banser. Van, nice to meet you, man. Cheers. Woo. Okay, so we have come to the Roadhouse on Manila Bay. Everybody's out here in the bay watching the sunset, so perfect timing for us. We got our first local beers. So San Miguel, Pale Pilsen, and Red Horse. Okay, to the victory of the Phoenix Fuel Masters, huh? Phoenix Fuel Masters, that's such a mouthful. I feel like a lot of the teams here in the Philippines had like really long basketball names whenever I was looking at the list. Don't you think? They're just the sponsors. Babe. Oh, the sponsors are in the name? What's a fuel master? Like a, a gas company? To the Phoenix Fuel Masters. <laughs> to the victory! So this Red Horse beer brings back some really good memories when we were on Port Barton. We went on a boat tour and one of the guys working on the boat invited us to drinks afterwards and we drank with all his local friends. It's very interesting how they drink. They drink out of the big bottle. So you take a drink and then pass on the next person and kind of just pass around the table and you share a beer. Such good memories. Salud. Game time? Game time. Okay, is there any place to get drinks or something beforehand? Recommend? Not sure. In second floor, there are many stores. Here. Second floor. Okay, cool. Thanks, guys. Where'd you get the t shirt? Yeah. We, we need one. Yeah. That's sweet. Oh, perfect. Yeah. Thank you so much. Good. I'm official now. <laughs> San Miguel Light. I refuse to drink a beer with a straw. I like it. Thank you. Appreciate it, guys. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> All right. Yeah, maybe not. <laughs> that was cute. All right, we're in. It's fun. Okay. We ate the Jollibee. We learned how to drink. We're in the game. All right, just got our seats. Here we are. There's the court. Thank you, J3. I appreciate it, man. These seats are awesome. Ladies and gentlemen, attention, please. About to start the show. Better take your seats.